friends often students get confused in finding which one of the two given fractions is greater or which one of them is less that concept is used in arranging the given fractions like you are given three or four fractions and you have to arrange them in ascending and descending order so they tend to take lcm of all the fractions and then equalize the denominators and then compare the numerators that's the normal process which is followed by most of the students now in this video i shall tell you a very very simple process by which you can identify which of the two fractions is greater look at this the first one suppose you have 8 upon 3 and 7 upon 5 now i want to find which of these two is greater see the numerator here 8 is giving a product of 40 with the denominator so always go by the numerator first so 7 giving a product of 21 so which product is greater 40 is greater right so 40 is greater than 21 that means 8 by 3 is greater than 7 by 5 very very simple now this is how you need to identify which of the fraction given to you is greater these steps which i have written is just for explanation you don't need to write those steps suppose you are given 3 upon 7 and say 2 upon 9 now see 3 into 9 is 27 you have to write the product below the numerator which you are considering so 3 into 9 27 2 into 7 14 so 27 is greater therefore 3 by 7 is greater than 2 by 9 likewise suppose you have 11 by 13 and on the other side you have suppose 14 by 15 now you see 11 into 15 is going to give me 165 and 14 into 13 140 plus 42 182 so 182 is greater that means 14 by 15 is greater so the side which gives you a greater product that side fraction will be greater now you can use this for arranging into a, in ascending or descending order like suppose you have to arrange 2 by 5 7 by 9 and 3 by 7 in ascending order or descending order so i will try and find the smallest one first see this is giving me a product of 18 this is giving giving me a product of 35 so obviously 7 by 9 is greater than 2 by 5 so if this is greater i will not consider this this is the greater because i, I want the smallest one first now consider these 14 and 15 so 15 is now this one is greater so this is the smallest now see the ease with which I have found the smallest. No LCM, nothing. You find the smallest one so easy. So 2 by 5 is the smallest. Now between these two, this is 49 and this is 27. So 49 is greater. So this is the greatest. Because this 27 is the smaller. So 3 by 7 is the next. And then finally 7 by 9 is the greatest. So in competitions, you need these kind of smart methods, you know. And if you know these kind of smart methods, nothing like it. Go for the 24 PDF short trick course, friends. This is just amazing. You know, all these short tricks which I keep on telling you, these are all mentioned in a compiled manner uh, in this course. And if you have not got a copy of this course, you are, you know, uh, just missing out on something very, very important. So, how do you get a copy of this? You can download it from www.sureshagarwal.in. That's the website. Or if you are not using uh, the you know browsers, then go for WhatsApp 989636963. That's the number on which you can send me a message. I'll tell you how to get a yeah, copy yeah. of that 24 PDF course. All these short tricks you know mentioned in that particular PDF course. So if you like this video, do share it with all your friends, especially the junior ones who are in school, so that they can do it without taking the LCM. And don't forget to subscribe the channel for more such useful videos.